I started coaching the Orange County Special Olympic swim team 25 years ago. And uh, shortly after that, and well, in 2001, we had our first open water swim here. So I, I've been with Special Olympians, and I've been involved with the swimming component of Special Olympics, like I said, for a, a full 25 years longer now with the open water swimming stuff. And, and the one thing I, I like to tell folks about Special Olympians is, when you're coaching Special Olympians, the thing you've got to realize is they are just like everybody else. They have boyfriends and girlfriends. They get in arguments. They, they, they're just like a regular swim team. And so what you want to do is you want to treat them like a like regular swim team. And we strive very hard to do that. Our program really was just like a regular swimming team. As a matter of fact, one of my favorite stories is one day I was on the deck coaching and a person that was new to the aquatic center came up to me and says, coach, what team is that that's in the water? And I said, well, that's the Special Olympics team. And they just laughed and they said, no, seriously, what team is in the water? And I said, no, these are Special Olympians. And then they came up to the wall and they're taking off their goggles and he goes, oh my God, they're so good. I thought this was a high school swimming team. So that made me feel real good. I felt like we accomplished what we were trying to do. I believe it is all about inclusion. This lake swim is about inclusion. Special Olympics is about inclusion. So this is a perfect meld between two worlds.